I was a commander of ODA 574. Being a commander has a lot of different meanings depending on where you are and I suppose uh, what your mission is. As a special forces team leader, I was responsible for 11 men on my 12-man team. And I was responsible for controlling the chaos so I could unleash my men on the enemy. My men focused on unconventional warfare. That meant that each of my men was given responsibility for training, equipping, leading guerrillas, leading by example, starting an insurgency, facing terrible odds, and largely having to uh, act as individuals at times. I needed to be able to empower each of my men so they could go off with uh, different groups of guerrillas and accomplish some uh, extremely hazardous and difficult tasks. It, it, it was a extremely uh, challenging job because I wanted my men to push back against me. I wanted them to be individual thinkers. And so I had to find a way to, uh, on the one hand, keep everybody uh, united enough that we could move towards a common goal. But at the same time, I had to encourage individuality and encourage a rebelliousness, which they could then uh, inspire their guerrillas with as we attempted to overthrow, in this case, the Taliban. Thank you.